Hey folks, it's Robert O'Brien from Good Life Tea. Hey, I just wanted to show you how to use Shopify today. I'm specifically talking about your inventory in your products page. Okay, so products page is um, in your Shopify. I picked a, a random product here. I'm going to scoot down and go to the image uh, inventory section. As you can see, I've got uh, several different variants of this particular product and uh, to change the inventory whoops to change the inventory you hit the edit button and that'll raise up the um, <clears throat> details on your variants here um, etc red price the compare price and then inventory so right now we're not tracking the inventory on this guy and we would like to track it so I click that button then you got to add the amount that you got on hand. I've got six of these bad boys, so I'm going to put six in there. And then this button here is very interesting. Um, this allows the customer to purchase the product even when it's out of stock. This is good and this could be bad. Um, if it's out of stock, you can't ship it. Then you got to call a customer and say, hey, we don't have it. Um, you want something else instead. You don't lose the sale, but you might annoy the customer. But if you uh, click this button here, it'll say sold out on your um, on your website and it'll direct the customer to buy something else or not buy it at all. Um, so that's your choice. That's how you use this button. And then once you hit the save button, now that item was going to be saved and we did it for the red one only. So we got to go back in here, unfortunately, by hand and change all of these if, you, if you're interested in changing the inventory levels. Um, so that's there you go. That's how you uh, change inventory in Shopify uh, one by one by hand. And um, it's important that you keep your inventory straight so you don't sell things you don't have. There you go. Thanks a lot for watching. Robert O'Brien, Rob the Tea Guy. GoodLifeTea.com.